what's up everyone it's your girl deja and welcome back to another video in today's video i am going hygiene shopping at target as you guys can see i'm in the aisle now i have a list of everything that i want to get so i can stay within a budget and not grab things i don't need but if you guys are excited to see this video make sure that you guys like comment and subscribe so the first thing I'm looking at are the mouthwashes. I have this one by Therabreath. I really like it, but I do want a stronger mint taste. This one I think will give that. This is their invigorating icy mint. And one of my subscribers says that she really likes this one. This one is in sparkle mint, which sounds really interesting. And it says healthy smiles. So this one is geared to fighting cavities. So this one sounds really good too. So eventually I am gonna try either this one or this one. I honestly never get my floss from here because I always go to Dollar Tree because look at this price, $3.19. You can get like the same thing at Dollar Tree. So that's what I do. If I do get them from Target, I will get like the least expensive ones because it's just floss. Like you don't need the most expensive floss. And they do have a lot of electric toothbrushes. I definitely want to get a new one because the one I currently have is messed up. So eventually I do need to grab this. Since they don't have the one that I want from Method Body, I am going to pick up a Dove Body Wash. They have so many, so I'm going to see which one smell good. So this one is the Renewing one. This is in the scent Peony and Rose Oil. So let's see what this smells like. It smells really good. It definitely has that like flowery smell. So I'm going to smell some other ones. This is their Hydrating Aloe and Birch Water Scent. So let's see. This smells good. I may get this one, so let's see. So I decided to go with this one because it smells really good and it doesn't have too strong of a scent, but it is very refreshing. And I see that they have a native body wash here. That's really cool. To me, I don't think the price is worth it. Like for this little amount is $4. I guess if you're traveling, that's really good, but I feel like I might as well like try the larger size before I try like the smaller size one. But they have like a lot of different things here. They have dry shampoo. I love this dry shampoo. And they even have Shea Moisture here. I feel like when it comes to hair products, it is really good to try a sample size just in case if it doesn't work for your hair. You don't want to pay the full price. So I feel like this is really good. But they have a lot of different ones here. Also in this section, they have Dr. Bronner's lip balms. I've never seen this before. This one is organic and this one, well, this one is organic naked and this one is organic peppermint. So I don't know the price of it, but I've never seen this before. So I am definitely interested in this. So now I'm looking at the lotions. I definitely want to grab some more Palmer's cocoa butter because I really like this. And when I break out or if I have like acne scars, this really helps. I've noticed that it will definitely help fade my scars. So if you guys haven't tried it, definitely try it out. And I really like the smell of cocoa butter. So I think it smells really good. They also have this Jergens lotion. This one seems really cool because it says it is for breathable hydration for comfortably moisturized skin. That's a lot to say, but I really like the packaging of it. I feel like this one will be more of a, like of a lightweight lotion. So maybe one day I'll try this. This one seems really cool too, the raw sugar lotion. As you can see, they have it taped all up. This is like the most expensive one I see. So I can't even really smell it, but it seems like it's supposed to really hydrate your skin. This is an interesting scent too, watermelon plus fresh mint. Now I'm looking at the different bath salts. This one looks really cool. This is the lavender with aloe and vitamin E. They also have a bunch of different other ones. They have a white tea one. And oh my gosh, look at this. What, what even is this? Exfoliating sugar scrubs. I've never seen this before, so these look really cool. The price is $9.99, so that's a little expensive, but it definitely does look cute. Have you guys heard of this before? It is by June and Moon. I've never heard of it, so it's new to me. Anytime I come to the store, I just always look at the scrubs. There are just so many, and a lot of the times they'll come out with new ones. I honestly want to try them all, but I can't so I'm gonna smell a couple though 
so this is the cotton candy one i've seen this one a lot so i'm curious to see what this would smell like it doesn't really smell like cotton candy to me it honestly like smells hey you work here i'm filming <laughs> <laughs> How are Damn, you? Girl. I don't know, like candy vibes. The, I, that's literally like the best way I can explain it. I wouldn't get this one. I don't like the way this smells, but it is pretty. So the next one I'm gonna smell is this coconut lime one. I love coconut scents, so I am excited to try this one. This one smells so good. Like, yes, it smells like coconut and lime. I would definitely get this one one day because it definitely has like a nice refreshing scent. I feel like that's the scent I like. Like things that smell either like kind of floral or have like a very refreshing smell. Dr. Tills also has some scrubs and it is cheaper. Theirs are $4.89 and Treat Hut is $7.99. So if you're looking for something that is cheaper, I feel like this would probably be very good. I love this brand. Like I never tried anything that was bad. So eventually I would definitely have to try this out. All right, you guys, I got everything that I need. Now I'm going to head to check out. And then once I get home, I will show you guys everything that I bought. So I am back at home and now I'm going to show you guys everything that I got and you guys today was a hassle to film like everyone was at Target today usually I try to go later in the day I went a little bit earlier than usual and never again like it was just kids in the aisle making a lot of noise so I had to like wait a little bit each and every time to like film and talk but I was able to get the content for you guys so let's get into the haul. The first thing I'm going to show you guys are the soaps. I got a lot today because I've been running out. So the first thing I got is some bar soap. This is the Dove Sensitive Skin Soap. When I went in, I wanted ivory soap because I love ivory soap, but they didn't have it. So Dove is still really good. I also got a Dove Body Wash. This is their hydrating aloe and birch water scent and it refreshes and invigorates skin. So it smells really good. I really wanted basically a morning body wash because I feel like a lot of my body washes were geared towards the nighttime. So this to me is like a refreshing scent I would want to smell in the morning. The next body wash I have is actually by Target. I have never tried this before but the smell, you guys, is so amazing. That's why I got it. I didn't plan on getting another body wash, but it smelled so good. This is their Soothe and Soften Shea Butter and Oatmeal Body Wash. And for the price, you guys, this costs $2.79 and it is 24 fluid ounces compared to Dove. It is 22 and this is less money. Of course, they are different body washes, but if you're looking for something that you can get a lot out of for a good price, smells good, like this is definitely a great body wash. The last thing I got in terms of body washes is actually a bubble bath. So this is the one I got. I got this in a baby section. This is Mr. Bubble, America's favorite bubble bath. It is hyperallergenic and paraben and tear free and it is dermatologist tested so this was a really good price and honestly i just wanted something to like give my bath more bubbles because like using my other bubble baths they are more pricier so i don't want to like really use those to get my bubbles i want to use this to get my bubbles and then like i'll go with my dr teal sleep bath and like get that scent with it but i am so excited to try this out i feel like a little kid and like the packaging is just so cute cute and like happy also from the baby section i got baby wipes this is the pamper sensitive skin one i love these i use it on my face honestly sometimes when i have makeup and it works really well i'm not saying you should do that i usually try to like stick to an actual like makeup remover and not use wipes but sometimes i am tired so i'll use this but these are also good for freshening up as well in terms of lotion i got this one this is the palmer's cocoa butter formula i love this lotion it is very hydrating and smooth of course like I don't use this one every day because sometimes I'm not feeling the cocoa butter scent but honestly though I will always use this on my back and like the areas I break out because this 
is really good for those areas and I noticed that like my dark marks actually started to fade using this and I feel like these two paired together will like make a really good scent. The last thing I got is some deodorant. This is the Degree Motion Sense. This one is anti-yellow stains and anti-white marks. Honestly, I only got this because they didn't have any other ones. I like getting the ones that have like different scents, but I am curious to see how this one works. I'm not really like too worried about yellow stains, but the white marks definitely do happen with my other deodorants, so I'm excited to use this. That is it for the video guys. I hope you guys enjoyed going hygiene shopping with me at Target and also showing you guys everything that I got. If you guys enjoyed this hygiene shopping video plus haul, make sure that you guys subscribe to my channel. I love you guys so much. Bye!